Today's evening devotional. Love friend and foe alike. Social to save. Which now of these three, thinkest thou, was neighbor unto him that fell among thieves? And he said, He that shewed mercy on him. Then said Jesus unto him, Go, and do thou likewise. Luke chapter 10 verses 36 and 37. Christ came to break down every wall of partition. He came to show that his gift of mercy and love is as unconfined as the air, the light, or the showers of rain that refresh the earth. He made no difference between neighbors and strangers, friends, and enemies. He passed by no human being as worthless. In whatever company he found himself, he presented a lesson appropriate to the time and the circumstances. Every neglect or insult shown by men to their fellow men only made him more conscious of their need of his divine human sympathy. He sought to inspire with hope the roughest and most unpromising, setting before them the assurance that they might become blameless and harmless, attaining such a character as would make them manifest as the children of God. Often he met those who had drifted under Satan's control and who had no power to break from his snare. To such a one, discouraged, sick, tempted, fallen, Jesus would speak words of tenderest pity, words that were needed and could be understood. Others he met who were fighting a hand-to-hand -hand battle with the adversary of souls. These he encouraged to persevere, assuring them that they would win. At the table of the publicans he sat as an honored guest, by his sympathy and social kindliness showing that he recognized the dignity of humanity, and men longed to become worthy of his confidence. Though he was a Jew, Jesus mingled freely with the Samaritans. He slept with them under their roofs, ate with them at their tables partaking of the food prepared and served by their hands taught in their streets and treated them with the utmost kindness and courtesy. And while he drew their hearts to him by the tie of human sympathy, his divine grace brought to them the salvation which the Jews rejected.